Hello guys, welcome to the new tutorial and in today's tutorial I'm going to teach you how to work with list tag in HTML. So let's, uh, as we all know that uh, paragraphs are the one to organize text, but paragraphs are used to organize text in a block, not list. But, but what if you have list, then what? So HTML provides you some tags used to create order list and order list and definition list. So this is a great way to organize this if you want to illustrate concept with a set of points instead of paragraph. So in this tutorial we focus on order list, unorder list, definition list and nested list. A nested list is a list within a list. Let's start writing a code by just putting a exclamation mark. So as you can see our whole code is automatically added by the IDE and this is the one more advantage of your IDE. For this, I'm going to title my web page uh, the list tag because we are going to deal with the list different list in our HTML. So let's name it as title. Let's give the name of our web page to list tag. After that, just uh, whereas we are going to work with the order list, our order list is just consists of your numbers and letters to each item in a list. So let's start by start setting up the order tag, which is the OL tag and adding item to an order tag by using li tag which means the list items so as many number of list item you want to add just put as many number of list tag with them so for this on for this order list uh, i'm going to list some food names fruit names such as mango banana and orange after listing your items you can just open launch it with the open server and you can see your output is, is in listed form which by default is in starting with your number format 1, 2, 3 but if you want to change the type of your listing you can just go and type and after typing the word, the word type you can mention your uh, order of your listing of your list for this I'm going to start with the capital alphabet A as you can see my list got organized in a alphabetical order after that if you want to start with a small letter also you can do the same as you can see now the letter start from the small a b c d and you can also work with the roman letters as you can see by putting the i small i or capital i or uh, this is organized with the Roman number, but if you and if you want to start with some other numbers, but look, uh, if you want to start with um, five, six, seven, as I you can see, I have mentioned they start with five. So now my list starting with the Roman number five, and in this way you can list your items. But and let's take it another example. If we are going to start choose a type uh, capital A and starting our alphabet with the number 12 so now let's see what our output is so let's launch it with the open server and now you can see that my alphabets are from L, M, N and the L is a 12 letter of your alphabets so it starts from there and now let's start with the unordered list uh, unordered list is nothing just uh, unordered list is just consists of your bullet point as you have worked in a word file so as you have seen over there some bullet points or like your arrow and all in html we also have a another list uh, which by default is start with the disk uh, this another but if you want to change the type you can just type the word type and you can mention the type of your list for this i'm going to choose my type circle so I'm just going to write circle in between the inverted commas. Uh, after that, let's check our output. As you can see, my list is now ordered with a circle unordered. And now let's just change the circle to the square. And you can now see that my output is with the list of uh, square form. And in another list, there is no starting. Uh, starting property because it is an order list. It have no, it doesn't consist of your numbers or your letters, so you cannot mention this starting uh, 
starting point of your another list so now let's move on to the definition list uh, definition list a definition list is a list of words definition in a certain manner a definition will display the word just above its definition uh, definition list are of three types dl which means to begin with the d definition list dt begins with the definition term and the dd which means define a term in a definition list so when it, as you have i want to define my list over here so as you can see my dt dt means the def definition term is speed academy here and now i want to define my speed academy term over here so i am putting uh, the definition in between the dd tag which means defining the uh, term of so for now i'm going to define like this uh, speed academy is the best platform for learning uh, free course uh, after that you just you can just save this file and open up with the live server and now you can just see your output as uh, let's see what our output is as you can see speed academy is written and get bolded as i have put the bold tag over and my definition is just below the speed academy term definition term so and now if you want to work with the list within a list mean a nested list a nested list help us to make a list uh, whenever we make a sub point of a list as you can see uh, the mango has now got sub point like mango banana orange and all in this way you can work with different listing tags so meet you in the uh, next video till then stay safe guys and keep practicing bye bye